How's it going everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Brian and today we have some Clash Royale content coming for you guys. I know it's been dry recently but so is the game. It is slowly dying. Clan Wars 2 has not put the effort back in but there is a lot of you guys that are still playing the game but I'm going to be bringing you something special today. We have the best free to play deck in the game. I have been crushing ladder with this. There's no legendary so you guys can come along and get involved. The only card you might struggle with is the Electro Spirit if you don't have it up to level yet but we're going to get into that in a minute if you guys are new or into here please make sure to drop a sub down below so you do not miss a class royale video i have been doing a bit of warzone i've been doing a bit of streaming over on twitch as well the link will be down for that below so without any further ado let's get into this deck and show you guys how it plays let's go so guys this is the deck here it is a dual lane push deck as you can see there is no legendary cards and only one epic so a lot of you free to play players will be able to enjoy this deck the only cards you might struggle with is the electro spirit but we can get on with that anyway because you can sort of sub that in for the other spirits as well so let's get into some matches that can show you how the deck works okay so for match number one we are up against ooh, salvatore monday from one gaia Relier clan Literally had to use both of this, but we're up against some sort of bait deck and we do okay against that So we're not too worried right now Obviously things change when it comes to them Let's get the goblin cage to pull that over. This seems to be the rapid one though And I should really expect that uh, goblin barrel to come back right away It's gonna get the zappies down there. Yep As expected you will have log we're going to bar barrel that because we're just going to keep the fireball in and then we're going to go for royal hogs down this side oh goblin gang as well so we're going to get quite a few shots off there taking a bit of a leave we're going to get flying machine down in the middle we are just going to take them shots over there because the flying machine will turn over which is good so we're taking quite a bit of a lead here don't know if the ice spirit was the right move, but we've got fireball straight away for this. Just do not want to take any shots of that. Let's get the zappies now in the princess. Just keeping the pressure on. We want to get the royal recruits down when it's the right time, but not until double elixir, I don't think. So now we've got the bar barrel for the next wave of goblin barrels coming through. going to play the electro spirit because we don't really want to take any swings oh there we go anyway let's go royal hogs now keep that electro spirit behind it hmm goblin gang and that's so used eight i use six i don't know where that is but i'm going to play it behind yeah probably the best place you can now let's get the royal recruits down okay a couple of spear goblin shots there not our friend Get the fly machine up here now. Connect onto that princess, please. I'm just going to split the zappies. And let's do split three royal hogs going one way. And let's fireball this side. Huge damage over here on the left hand side. That log's going to do bits though. Please bring that down to the whole way. The whole way will be good. Let's get Royal Recruits down. Zappy's there on a clutch. Love to see it. Now we get a bar barrel here onto the Goblin Gar. Goblin Gang? Goblin Barrel. We just need to defend for 14 seconds. He's not going to be able to get through. No chance we have too many hard counters now for that. But yeah, this deck absolutely crushes against these sort of bait decks, which they've been in the meta too long. They need to be destroyed. I've actually been saying it for a long time. Log bait needs a revamp because it's just been so OP. It's basically just a rock with a bit of scissors on the end because you can still beat any sort of deck. Whereas there's a lot of decks out there that just don't have the oomph on it. So we'll take that one there, a nice and easy one to start things off. And we're going to go into another one here. We are, oh, I can't say that, from Big Korea. Let's see how we go on. Straight away with the bandit. That's probably the best thing ever. Because we can get the royal recruits down. It's not, it's not even going to kill one of them. Pekka. Okay, so we've got the zappies. And, oh, in fact, let's get the fire machine down here in the middle. Because I should expect a mega minion to come down any second now. That flying machine's going to do bits. Oh, you love to see the inferno dragon though when we've got zappies. 
fly machine do you fancy turning over there let's just get the zappies down for this now we'll take that one but i didn't even realize how much damage we've done to that tower over there i think we're just going to fireball that because a zappy might be able to kill that even just a couple of shots onto the tower come on there you go you love to see that so he's used all that elixir there we'll use the royal hogs now he's got a bandit a log that's not really going to do it probably going to get that town tower down to about 400 something i may even take it yeah 400 let's get the bandit here right on cue before it gets his charge see when you time them to perfection it's absolutely incredible you feel amazing Let's get the Royal Recruits going four down the left hand lane now. He's going to start things off again with the Inferno Dragon. So we've not even used the Electro Spur. That's how, like, it's not the most important card in the deck. It's useful, but not the most important. That's why it is possible for you to switch out for various different things. We are going to fireball that because we don't want that Ice Wizard to get a shot off. Okay, he's going to come down with a Bandit now. think when it's in walking range oh, it's not going to be in walking range but we'll take it so we can just cycle fireball here to get that how did that bandit get a dash off there i'm going to go th all four down this lane now as the electro spur uh, e-jank goes away now it's time for the electro spur oh i played right into the log though you got good value there zappy's down this side and we're going to want to get them royal recruits down as that pekka hits We'll get a wee bar bar over here. This is just painful for him to watch. Like, he cannot get through in the slightest. I think we might have just given value there again with the E Spirit. Zappy's down now for the Inferno Dragon. So, if you see this, this deck is quite popular, you know, this P.E.K.K.A. deck. So, there's quite a good hard counter to that. Because there's no chance they're getting through with Bridge Spam. 12 seconds left. We just play a cage over here, distract over them. They ain't getting through. How much damage did we take there? Like less than a thousand. And that is a very popular deck, that Pekka deck. So you guys really want to check this one out. It's absolutely crushing it so far. Let's keep going. We'll do one more match. As you can see, we're two for two right now, taking out Log Bay and Pekka decks, which, as you know, very popular decks. They're kind of everywhere. So we want to keep them pressure up now. We want to come up against hopefully a different deck here, not Mega Knight. That's, that's one that we always lose against is Mega Knight decks. We're up against Saddle, because obviously splash damage is absolutely destructive, but... That's just ones you want to stay avoiding from, but it's all, as you know, rock, paper, scissors, and not 3D chess like it used to be. So we're up against Londuria Esport. Um, it's going to go Magic Archer. That's a good sign, because that could be another Pekka deck. Hopefully get Flying Machine now. It's going to go Poison. Okay, I'm going to go Royal Hogs down this side then. Valkyrie, that's not what you want to see. That really puts the line out that you might also have a Mega Knight. Let's play the Goblin Cage. Can you come over here? Okay. Let's get the Zappies over here. That's not too bad. We'll take that all day long. I might just get a Bar Barrel down here to tank for that. As I've still got four Elixir in the drawer. Okay, E Spirit as well, so I can get his Royal Recruits time. Get that bandit down. Oh, we've got Fireball for this, if we can make it. That should be fine. No hits off, and a couple of Royal Recruit shots there, just to make sure that damage goes down even further. And he comes now in with a Meg, uh, the Valkyrie, so let's get the Flying Machine down. I don't know why I did that. That was just a waste of one elixir. Bandit there was huge. I probably should have brought it within range of that dying so it didn't get the dash off. Oh dear. I uh, shouldn't have done that one. Them's going to get hit. Valkyrie's going to come in again. Oh no. Oh, them Royal Hogs are going to get a huge amount of damage. Valkyrie out of cycle there. Let's get the Goblin Cage down now for that. 
going to poison that side. I don't agree with that. You could have handled that better. Perfect. Takes that out. That's going to get hit. Now we just need to defend Royal Recruits here. What's his win condition? I'm really struggling to figure out what... Oh, there's Pekka now. And, yeah. I don't know why you've waited this long to play it. 17 seconds left. Goblin Cage over here. thing is we need to get round to Royal Recruits here quickly. That should be fine and we'll take it there. So we come against two P.E.K.K.A. decks there, but popular decks, so you want to know how to play them, that's how you do it. And a love bait deck there for three for three wins with this deck. You guys really, really need to check it out. It is absolutely insane how easy this deck is to level up if you are a free-to-play player. You want to give it a go. And because of what they announced, there's not going to be any buffs or nerfs to any of these cards. So make sure you try and level these ones up. If you want to start climbing ladder faster, it's absolutely incredible. Thank you so much for everyone who's watching. If you did like the video and you do go on to use this deck please drop a like down below and if you are new around here please drop a sub i really really appreciate all the support we've had so far on the channel although clash royale has been dying i have still been trying to bring you content been doing streams over on twitch which you can check out in the link down below that's going to be it for today guys thank you very much for tuning in and i will see you my phone just fell tomorrow Bye bye